let's just get into this beat lashes shop sin city out of the six dollar um lash category i advise you guys if you see a style in there that you like to get them because once my six dollar lashes sell out i probably won't do any more six dollar lashes honestly i don't know that's kind of where i'm at but if you see a style you like make sure that you get them because i might not do six dollar lashes no more but i might keep a few styles to add to the website but they'll be starting at eight dollars so you can get that but okay anyway what's up you guys and welcome back to my channel and if you're new hi i'm sin and welcome to my channel in today's video i'm basically the uh i'm basically going to be um packaging up these lashes into my new lash boxes and getting them ready and i'm also going to be wrapping up my secret santa lashes for the sale if you guys do not know i am doing a sale up until christmas which is when you buy two lashes you will receive a free mystery lash that will be wrapped up in christmas paper with a little bow here is um where did it go this is my like demo not demo but my tester basically so it's for pictures you buy two you get a little lash that comes packaged like a christmas present so cute so i'm going to be doing that today but also make sure you check out the video before this of me straightening my hair and the new products that i use now to um straighten out my weaves and stuff my little bundles so enough for the introduction let's go ahead and get into what i'm going to be uh, what i'm going to be doing in this video so if you guys know black friday i basically sold out and black friday um i had these little cases for um like my lashes and stuff which if you get like the styles that i still have in these then you will receive these lashes and if you see me look down i have a mirror in front of my thing so i can kind of see but you'll receive these but if you order from the styles that sold out and i'm reopening then you're going to receive them in my boxes in these white trays so in here is around 200 lashes i decided i might as well re-up re-up so i don't have to re-up you know for a long time hopefully not hopefully but you know i can have a nice time frame like when i have sales i don't have to worry about selling out so early in the sale it gives people more of a chance to you know purchase basically so i have my handy dandy notebook that i got customized with my business name it looks like my business cards basically my business cards and my um thank you cards and then on the bottom it has my name ceo and head doll in charge because you know i run tennessee the beauty but anyway on um the second page i have basically my styles corresponding with the number that my vendor puts on my lashes so i'm just going to start and basically i'm only gonna do like 10 of the ones that do good and then like five of the other ones because i don't want to you know put them in boxes and then i sell more of one style so i need to actually re up and put them in the boxes and i don't use them all on another lash so I'm just gonna do 10 so this is this is my style hot girl and this is what hot girl looks like she's real cute so and all i do really is take the top cover off and then slide into the box I love my box they're so adorable so basically i might wrap up 12 
because I think I want to do two of each styles wrapped up in the paper because I want this to be a mystery to me and a mystery to you like I don't want you to feel like I am um like you know putting in different style like you know I want it to be to kind of to feel like it's cre like secret sound for like you don't know I don't know I don't know that's how I think secret sound go so that's how I want to do it so just basically I think first I'm gonna go ahead and like build my boxes just to make it easy so I don't know how many is in this wrap because I ordered 500 of these boxes so I don't know how many comes in each wrap. I'm not going to see how many. I'm just going to count out. So I'm just gonna build the boxes. So all you gotta do is like go to the corners and then like pop it like this and then square out the sides and then just close one in. And y'all highly recommend getting these kind of boxes because number one, they're lightweight. Number so that means you going if you ship out your lashes and gonna save on shipping costs. Number two, they're more they're inexpensive. Like they're so inexpensive. Most of these boxes be like one to two dollars, like one fifty to two dollars a piece, and then they minimum quantity be like three hundred boxes. But no, go up paper boxes and just make sure you get a vendor. I would say get the boxes that's big enough to fit these kind of um trays, and then um just order the trays from them as well. For your smaller lashes, like this. So basically, when you get my smaller lashes, the tray gonna be clear. And then when you get my 25 mm lashes, they're gonna be white. So just get trays from your vendor, because if you get the small boxes, then you are, you can't put 25 mm in there. And also, if you're just getting your box from your vendor, you're not getting your lashes. And when you order your 25mm, like, if you did want to have all clear um, boxes, I would recommend you telling your vendor, like, up front when you order the boxes, hey, I need um, trays that fit 25mm lashes. <clears throat> Excuse me. Because they won't fit in your box correctly with the clear, like, with the ones that's meant for smaller lashes. The top of them is going to be up against the box and it's going to bend the hairs off on the side. Just let you guys, you know. Oh yeah, also I did mention that, um, you know, our, that my room is getting you know done up or whatever so once it's finished and i get it decorated how i want to do it and whatever else i'm going to do a small room tour because i have a small room but it's gonna be cute you know you get to see my theme and all the cute stuff i don't even got my curtains up yet it's just i'm being lazy but we ain't gonna talk about it oh yeah and also i have a little trash thing right here beside me so i done folded up a few more and i'm just gonna do the same thing in the boxes so now 
as you guys should know i use a dymo printer that i got from walmart which i will link down below but i have it in my other labeling my 25 mm lashes when i was labeling them in the circle cases i was using this and i still am using this and right now because i stacked up on so much white paper which now i'm on to like want to use clear so i'm trying to use up all the white paper so that like i can start using the clear because i don't want to use the clear and then be wasting the white paper so for now i'm using white but it's gonna it looks so much better with clear i done tried it so i know in the future it will be clear here i mean <laughs> clear labels so i have all of mine saved as you can see hot girl just popped up and i'm doing it in the medium font because i just like it it's not too big not too small I'm out of paper. Well, that's all I had. <laughs> Tony's another one. Yeah, this is something that you should stack up on. If you label a lot of items, I use these to label my lashes, lip glosses, um, basically all that kind of stuff. And I have a lot of lashes. I label every last lash with these, like, stay stocked up. Because you'll be hurt if you're trying to you know restock up for something and then now you out of this inventory is just not your products it's also you know what you use for your products so let's try it again low key i kind of want to get the one where you can tell it how many you want to print and it just prints it because this is for the birds but this is how the size look in medium you can see it. So it's a little peel at the back. You just peel them both off. <coughs> and I put mine at the top, which I think I might start putting it in the thing but i kind of want you to be able to see when you get it, like okay yeah this is the one that i ordered but we'll see so that's basically how it looks once it's all packaged hot girl info on the back and then make sure you hashtag shop Sin city so I'm about to just finish labeling the rest of these and then I'm going to come back and show you guys um my how I wrap them up and then I'm going to do like the rest of them off camera so I can take my wig off because y'all I'm starting to get a headache and having a wig on does not feel good while you have a headache so I'm going to try to hear if I do this. paper jams So now I'm going to take most of the stuff off of my bed <clears throat> and 
put this on my stool right here so that we can wrap up two of these. These up in there. Okay, so let me. So if you want to pretty much recreate the little Christmas thing that I did, you're going to need some wrapping paper. I got my four dollar. Some tape. I got two four dollar. <laughs> and then these little mini bows, a dollar. <laughs> you like you just you don't have to go all out to um you know make something cute. Everything was a dollar. I got it from Dollar General. So go to your little Dollar General and get on it. So basically, as you can see, I tried, I did one. That's why it's like cut right there. So, and y'all, since it is a dollar, it is pretty cheap for me. So I wouldn't use this to like wrap real gifts because it's easy to poke holes in it. So, you know, but it's good enough for this because it's easier to patch a little hole than to patch a big hole, basically. So, so I'm going to just sit it up here and kind of measure how I want it. And then I just cut. I got a piece about this big and y'all I honestly forgot how to wrap gifts you know what I'm gonna watch a video so we need to just cut off the additional we're not going to use so it looks sharper and then fold hmm. in again creasing the paper okay Okay, so based on the video, which I don't want to tape it too much because I want it to be easy to get to the lash. So I'm only going to tape it together. So that's the first thing. And then... I'm just making up stuff now. This is honestly how I wrapped it because I can't get it to be all cute like how the man is saying. Can you take my tape? So that's our one end look. I'm just going to do the same thing to the other one. <laughs> so yeah, I made a mistake and folded like one side. Yeah, whatever. And so then the last step is just to get you a nice little bow take the paper and just stick it on the gift. And then boom. You got your nice little gift. So like I said, I'm going to do like all the rest of the lashes off of camera and then show you once I'm done and then that'll be it for this video. So when, so see you in the next clip once I'm finished. All right, you guys. So it is 10 o'clock and I'm calling it quits tonight. I'm going to finish 
the rest tomorrow so you guys won't be able to see basically like everything as you guys can see i literally have all those lashes still left and i did 10 20 30 I did 34 lashes so far. So, hold on, hold on, let me show you guys what it looks like. So, these are the ones that I did. As you see, they stacked on each other. I've done Mistress, Drum Queen, and then Hot Girl. And then I've wrapped four of them up and put them on the bow. And that's the order, like I said. And then some of the boxes that I did put together. And then some that's left in this row. So, I'll be doing another row. But that's everything so thank you guys for watching hopefully i'll see you in my next video and yeah so if you like this video make sure you comment like comment and subscribe and hopefully i'll see you in the next one i love you guys this is signing off